Hello everyone. Today I'm going to show you how to develop augmented reality app that can uh, detect ground plane and uh, can place 3D game objects uh, on uh, ground plane without type any single code. So in this video I use 2022 Unity version. Uh, first you must create a empty 3D project. So then uh, type this URL uh, developer viewforia.com uh, then you can find out uh, viewforia engine developer portal so you can create a free uh, developer account in this uh, uh, website and uh, you can download this uh, viewforia engine unity uh, package so i already downloaded this uh, unity package and i already uh, installed this unity package package into my uh, project uh, then you must uh, select this uh, main camera and you can delete uh, your main camera in your uh, scene then you must create a new uh, AR camera game object now you must uh, configure this uh, AR camera then uh, go to uh, developer.viewforia.com then select this uh, develop tab uh, then go to license manager now uh, you can create a new license so then uh, click this get basic button you can give a name for your license then select uh, your project name this is the uh, product key uh, you can click it and uh, copy your uh, product key then go to uh, unity uh, click this open viewforia engine configuration button then you can paste your license key inside this uh, app license key text box now uh, you must create a, a game object a specific game object for a ground plane uh, detection uh, go to viewforia engine now go to ground plane then cr uh, create plane finder now uh, again go to viewforia engine uh, go to uh, ground plane then create a ground plane stage uh, now in the uh, plane finder uh, you must drag and drop this uh, ground plane stage in this into uh, this script uh, so in this case I already created uh, for uh, I already created a, a prefab using uh, four BMW cars so you can uh, see I have already uh, created four BMW cars uh, as a prefab uh, these are the normal uh, game objects so you can uh, download uh, any kind of models using uh, internet like pre uh, like uh, sketchfab so then I drag and drop uh, these uh, prefab uh, inside this uh, ground plane stage game object now uh, you can see uh, our four BMW cars appear like this. So this is uh, you can see a, a green color rectangle. This is the ground plane stage uh, game object. So these cars I scaled up uh, realistic mode. So then I add uh, images like this so these are the shadow images then I uh, added a reflection probe to uh, create a reflection on cars surface so in the plane finder uh, in the uh, content positioning behavior script uh, you can see uh, duplicate stage uh, and uh, it tick mark you must uh, remove this tick mark we can build this uh, unity scene to our a mobile phone go to files then uh, 
click this uh, build settings then select your uh, android platform and switch platform okay now uh, you must change a few uh, settings in player settings click this player settings in the in the other settings section uh, you must uh, change minimum api level to uh, android oreo i will select android uh, 8.0 uh, then i will select uh, this scripting backend to il2 cpp uh, then i tick mark this arm 64 uh, Then remove the tick mark on uh, auto graphic api then uh, remove this vulcan uh, graphic api using this minus uh, button now it's okay you can close this uh, player settings window then you can build it are uh, you first you must uh, add your sample scene into your build settings window uh, click at open scene then click build settings and then click build this is the final apk you can install this apk in your android mobile phone and uh, you can open your app it will open your main camera then you must aim your main camera to ground plane uh, like this then uh, the app identify this ground plane and uh, you can see a rectangle on uh, ground plane then you can touch your script then it will uh, place your 3d game objects on this ground plane 